Jesus. I know. I um haven't made a video in roughly seven months. No biggie, you know, just, I've been really busy. My birds are singing, interrupting. My brother is mowing the lawn, you know, just regular things to distract me from making this video anyways. Um, and I realized that I haven't made a video because you go. I've been working, count them, four jobs. I went insane. Um, cause I, you know, you girls gotta pay for college and all that. So she's gonna do it. She's gonna do it independently. You know, she's an independent woman. She knows how to do this. And so she's gonna do it. And by she, I mean me. And I don't know why I'm speaking in a third person, but that's gonna stop now because that's weird. It's weird. Um, so anyways, um, from working for jobs, I figured out a pretty quick, easy method of doing my makeup. Um, so that A, it's kind of fast so I can get to work on time because some days I would work from like 7.30 until 9.30 p.m. Um, not 7.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. Can you imagine that? That would be like an A plus shift. But like 7.30 a.m. until 9.30 p.m., which is fine, you know? Um, I was living life, earning money, all that good stuff. Um, but I needed it to be fast and I needed it to last all day. So I'm gonna show that to you now so thanks for joining me after seven long months oh and yeah i did get a tattoo and before anybody asks yes it's real i'm why do people need feel the need to be like is your tattoo real yes i paid a lot of money for it it's mine now let's just get into the video and what's your poppin everybody it's your girl voiceover anna i guess um to start off, I'm priming with a Murad primer. It has SPF in it because you know your skin's gotta stay hydrated and protected from the sun. Um, because us pasty Jewish girls out here, you know, we burn, but then we get kind of like brown. I don't know. Anyways, whatever, besides the point, I'm just taking that and I'm putting it all over my face, rubbing it in, all that good stuff. And that boy is empty now. I kid you not, when that when I said that boy is empty, I, I tried. I tried really hard to get any more out and I could just squeeze out the last little bit that I even owned. Um, but yeah, it feels really good to rub my face, so I just do that. I also take this primer down my neck because, you know, your neck skin is a part of your face, I guess. Next, I'm taking the Hey Honey Primer in my dirty, nasty beauty blender. And I'm just going to be putting my concealer underneath of my eye bags, around my nose a little bit where there's redness, um, on my chin. And I'm also spot concealing any pimples or anything like that. This isn't concealer that's meant to brighten. I'm just trying to go fast, trying to conceal those pimples, trying to make sure that I look okay and that, you know, my, my boss won't fire me because of cystic acne and all of that um although i have a pretty good wrap on my cystic acne so next i'm gonna be powdering using a blush brush which i have multiple uses for but i'm taking this cleanly suppressed powder in i think it's amber i think it's up it might be a lighter shade i don't remember but either way i've hit pan on this boy but when i like something you know i use it so don't yell at me for it it's gonna be dirty so i'm just taking that in the areas that i have just concealed making sure to put powder over top of them so nothing creases or anything like that not really being too excessive with the powder then i'm gonna be taking my luxi brush i don't know what it is and taking my ciate uh london bronzer and bamboo bronzer it's kind of light i got it in a sample so i'm trying to use that up and i'm just taking that around the areas that i would normally contour only i'm doing this a little bit more lightly because i'm not really going for uh you know some serious contour here i'm just trying to get a little bit bronzed then i'm gonna be grabbing that exact same brush okay don't come at me and i'm using it for my blush because it is a blush brush but whatever either way this is a tart blush in feisty i think it is and i'm just running that on the apples of my cheeks giving myself that youthful youthful glow oh, she's trying to be cute i see 
don't even remember doing that. Either ways, this is my highlight brush and this is my color pop highlighter. Listen, it's got a dent in it too, I know. But that's just because I love it and I use it. So I'm gonna be applying that to the tops of my cheekbones. I like to put it on my forehead too. Listen, your girl just likes to be shining absolutely everywhere. I also put it down the bridge of my nose as well as you'll see right here and i also like to take it on the tip of my chin too because i like to be shiny oh she winked at us shoot she's flirty then i'll take it on my finger as well and i'll put it on my cupid's bow and i really don't go too overboard with this highlight because it is already super duper reflective and shiny and it'll really catch light anyways then i'm gonna be taking my favorite lip gloss plumper ever it's by grande lips i paid 27 dollars for it because it was at the checkout at Sephora and I'm weak. So I'm just going to be taking that. Uh, usually before I even put on primer, I put on some type of balm or hydrating thing or plumping thing on my lips. Um, but I didn't today. So I'm going to be doing my eyebrows and there's like 2% left. So go me. Um, and this is my... This is the e.l.f. pencil that I said I hated, but I've been using it every day to the point where it's down to a nub, and I think that I can use it maybe one more time before I have to throw that boy away. Um, and I promised myself that I would be saving money for college rather than, uh, you know, spending it on an eyebrow pencil that I really don't need. But here I am, just filling in my brows with a nub. It's harder than it looks, but, you know, we're gonna finesse it. Next up is my liquid liner, and I'm using this EM Cosmetics uh, liquid liner in a Ciate London one, too. Um, and I cannot do it on camera, so I did it off camera because that was stressful as heck. Oh my gosh, I couldn't. So now um, I'm going to be applying falsies, so I just put on the lightest layer of mascara ever. Then I'm going to grab my falsies, which are the Alexis Lashes by AOA. They're a dollar. They cost a dollar, and they're my favorite of all time. Like, I will never have a different ride or die lash than this it's gotten to the point where they just pop onto my eye just because i wear them so much i'm so used to them and bro i just love them so much and the adhesive that i'm using like the glue is by kiss and the mascaras that i used i didn't even show but they're the better than sex mascara by Too Faced, and then the benefit roller lash um, which i only use on my lower lashes and on the tips of my um falsies and here i'm just blending my natural lashes with the fake ones all that good stuff she's feeling herself a little posing for the camera i think i was trying to get like a thumbnail here but it didn't didn't happen but either way you know she's feeling cute i don't know what i just said there but i'm doing my bottom lashes with the benefit roller lash just because it has those like plasticky bristles so it can really separate your lashes and coat them well which is usually what you need for like the tips of your lashes and your lower lashes i don't know it's just what i do don't judge me this is the finished look so thank you so much for watching i'm sorry about the five month hiatus but all i have to say to that is thank you so much kisses bye bye